Hi, you're watching another Honest Review and this time I'm looking at a few of the products from the L'Oreal Revitalift anti-aging range. I could see that they have become really popular um, and like everybody, I am looking to find a skincare range that is both affordable and effective. So L'Oreal seemed like a good starting point. And the product that really jumped out at me on pharmacy shelves was this one. This is their seven day replumping ampules and as they call it, their seven day cure. Uh, what, cure for, for facial aging? I mean, it's a pretty massive claim. But yeah, you get seven capsules in, in this box and it sells for about 20 pounds. It's not cheap. Seven capsules of hyaluronic acid serum. And the idea is that you use one a day over a seven day period and you should see a visible difference in your skin. In fact, um, they actually say um, on the product information that you should see some difference by just using one capsule. Now I've got to say, I used this over a six day period. The first thing I can say is that there's quite a bit of serum in each capsule. Um, so actually because i was wanting to focus around the eye area um i didn't always use a, a full one every night um but if you can see you just get this clear gloopy serum that is quite easily absorbed into the skin let's just pat it around completely unfragranced anybody with very sensitive skin and i have really pretty sensitive skin it's not going to have a, a problem with this. So, I mean, that was, that was um, a good start that very easy to use, um, feels nice on the skin. I have to say though, um, that I didn't really experience uh, a brilliant result with this. I and mean, I just couldn't see much difference in my skin. Um, if you go online on Amazon, for example, there's over four out of uh, five star reviews on there. So it's like something like 4.2 out of five stars is the average on Amazon. So there's a lot of happy customers. And then you get a few scattered among those reviews saying they didn't notice any difference at all. It may depend on your skin type. But what I did take away from it was it was a nice product to use. And actually, why would I want to buy something? Why would I want to pay 20 pounds for something that's only effective over a seven day period? Um, I mean, the benefit of using capsules like that means that the product is going to stay fresher for longer in that every day you're opening up a brand new capsule, you're getting fresh product, um, which is going to retain its sort of potency, basically. However, I see now that they are selling a hyaluronic serum in the UK. Apparently one sells out every minute in the USA. They're selling a bottle of the serum now um, for a not too different price that you could use over a longer period of time. That's one that I'm quite keen to try. Try it out over 30 days and then report back how that works. So um, when I bought my Revitalift products, I got a three for two. So I also picked up just a travel size. It's only 15 milliliters of their Laser Renew Day Cream. Again, gets a lot of positive reviews online. Um, the first thing I noticed about the day cream is that it is really highly fragranced. Um, but it's got a lovely, it, it's a nice fragrance, but usually on my skin, anything um, of that level of fragrance would bring me out in a rash. This surprisingly didn't. Um, and it is highly moisturizing settles down into the skin nicely. Quite a nice product to use. Because it's 15 milliliters, I haven't been able to use it for long enough to really report back on any um, great result, but that's a so far so good. And again, I'm gonna buy a full um, container of this and report back on what, what happens over a 30 day period. That's quite a nice start for this one. However, the main purpose of this video is to talk to you about the glycolic peel pads within the Revitalift range. Now, um, a lot of friends of mine have had facial peels in salons clinics um, and they've said they work really nicely for them, but you get a lot of skin irritation. I've tried salicylic acid um, and that brings me out in a rash just by looking at them. I just can't go near them. 
So I was interested to try the glycolic peel pads because that felt like if it worked, I might get a result, a kind of lower intensity. Um, so not getting the kind of irritation that you'd get in a one-off salon or clinic treatment, uh, but maybe getting some of the benefit and being able to use it over a longer period of time. And that is exactly what I've found with these peel pads. So it's 9.6% um, glycolic acid. You get 30 pads um, in this box or in this container. And I'm just looking up the price, about £22.50. I got these for on Look Fantastic. However, being Scottish and frugal, let me show you the the pads. There they are. You get a smooth side and a textured side, the textured side being better for exfoliation. But as I say, being a frugal type, I've cut mine in half. So I get to use them for twice as long. Um, there's honestly enough. These are saturated enough uh, that half a pad would do your whole face. I've not been doing under the eyes in this very sensitive area, but I've been doing the rest of the face. Um, I mean, the big benefit for me is that um, I don't get any irritation. I can use them. I use them pretty much daily. And I feel that they have um, kept my skin really clear and they've also helped to reduce pore size. Um, it's also supposed to be good for, for wrinkles. Uh, but just generally, I think I notice my skin smoother and brighter. Um, and it's been a really good one to use. So this I would recommend from the Revitalift range. And as I say, I'm going to try out um, a few of their other products for a longer period of time and report back. Um, as for the seven day cure ampules, I'm not so convinced on that one. I'd be interested to hear some of your thoughts if you've also tried it. This has been another honest review. My reviews are always just my own independent and unbiased opinion. There are lots of them on the channel. So um, if you have time, please watch some more of my videos and don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.